This video is brought to you by Tusk Tips, Tricks, Reviews, Unboxed on YouTube, and Hand Mobile Advertising on Facebook. Okay, so let me see the duration of this video. Details is fifty minutes and forty six seconds. So this is the amount of time it just didn't split up like I expected it to. Go ahead and use it in my final uh, videos. The attack stay pretty good. So I come down here, I come up here to, or down here to work in the videos. I'm finished. This one. Back to Wondershare. Okay. Go to um, God, I lost track of where I was. I'm working with audio and video. Put this one in its place. Now, what I actually wanted to do was this. Um, I guess I should have done it like this in the first place. Split it up in cores. Instead of merging them together, I'm going to add the same video four times. Do not merge them. This is how I've done it before. I just got curious as a call. Now I am going to hit edit and I'm going to trim. That marker down here and it gives that arrow going back and forth. I set that at the beginning. This goes to 8 and you can bring it all the way up near 15 minutes. It's 12 minutes. that for 12 minutes, add trim marker up on top, oh, I that under the I gotta remove that. <laughs>
do there. Alright. Go back. <laughs> and trim marker. Just do it this way. Yeah. I think I'll just go ahead and do it this way. It seems a lot easier. Seventeen point sixteen. Got that one in at twelve, seventeen, sixteen. Bring this one up to twelve, seventeen. Change my media. music on it so now I'm gonna go ahead and Testing one, 
two, three, testing, one, two, three. Testing, one, two, three, testing, one, two, three. Six, get it. I'll lower this down a little bit. That way it's out of the new way. It's basically, uh, I can come in here. First, let me get it all started. Okay, so I added the music with the media source. And now I'm going to go ahead and play with you guys. Uh, I do basically come in here and right in this area here I can adjust the volume. Um, let me bring that up a little bit on scale so you guys can see it. Uh, this is what I'm talking about. Come in here and go to settings, advanced audio properties, and then I adjust the media when it pops up here to where now this has to go to 36. here so I go in here I'm gonna delete that one because it ended up being just like this first try I'm doing this I keep forgetting to do the traditions the transition and it doesn't add the
it'll give you the option like I had. Lower this down a little bit. That way it's out of the way. It's basically, uh, I can come in here. Switch to What I can do with this in order to make it uh, sorry, in order to make it sound louder is This is the video that you guys just saw with just the music. video for working with audio video so what I'm gonna do is rename it working
how I added video five from uh, my long videos. And, yeah. and now I'm going to back out of here and go to my raw videos. I'll add these in. When I'm done with this video here, I'll add it and it will show you the full process of everything. Everything right there will come together and I'll have some good footage with this too. I'll put it, I'll merge it all together and then I'll uh, break it down into 15 part, 15, 15 minute videos and go from there like I did previously and a lot of this is a lot of repetition so basically uh, kind of get a gist of it when I get the ending or when I do the ending video I'll uh, make a video of that and then I'll put it together and show you guys but after that or until then I'm just going to uh, get this done and I will come back whenever I start the ending for my videos of, of working with audio yeah. so you get this taken care of okay I know I said that I was going to stop it there until I do the ending uh, video for my uh, working with audio videos but I wanted to show this because this time I wanted to share after did every single video and I can go through it. So I have them all merged together, volume set up, and I've got the video right here with everything that I've just added. And I can uh, now take this one and put it in working audio and video five scrolls I believe. So what I do is I go up to or down to my working audio and video folder to do on um, finished one and I get before I delete it. And I come back down to my wonder video. Add this one. This, by the way, is 55 minutes and 28 seconds, and I can cut those down into 15 videos as well as have the long uh, video too. Because I, I found that you know some people they like longer one hour, an hour and a half videos where other people they, they just like to watch 15 minute videos so I cut them down 15 minutes so that you know, I can help with people getting that too but this is the basic setup right here and I will take this one and I will put it on here and break it down into 15 minutes like so 15 minutes a piece. That will be here. And long bench videos. No audio and video five. Put it on there. <clears throat> and then I go into my raw video. And I can delete these. I have that one there. And then I do repeat the process for the first one. I spin them down into 15 minute videos. I already have that, so now I'll add this part to what I had on that one and I will go ahead and split it down into 15 minute videos. Okay, 
Okay, so just to bring you up to speed up to where I'm at, I went and finally did an ending video like I did with my uh, introduction video. What I basically did was the same procedure that I did to create my uh, introductory video. And I came down here and I made a new media source. This. So if you go in here, um, you can go here to create a media source. You can change the name. So I, all I have to do is hit existing, and then boom, you got my ending uh, right there. You can create a new one. But that's how I created my uh, ending. Video for uh, OBS to make my videos. And like I said, all I did is I duplicated the same procedure except for I came down and on my uh, my introduction video I muted the audio because I had to adjust it so that my voice could pick up. I have a very low voice and I had to work on it. And every time I try to use my mic with it, it was the background music was ramping out my voice, so I had to adjust it. I keep having a problem with remembering the settings to get that done right, so each time I had to adjust the settings. And that's why I said, you know, every time you do this stuff, you always check with, uh, check your audio, keep up with uh, because it'll sneak you up and bite you in the butt. But anyhow, that said, I'm going to show you my uh, finished results on on my uh, my video or my ending video. And I'm going to shut down this capture screen capture so that you guys can see it. There it is. I have both uh, YouTube and a Facebook uh, folder, and the 
the reason why I do that is because of the copyright I use the free music in order to do the introduction and the ending videos where I started doing it again. I uh, stopped doing it because when I first started getting into videos I started playing around with their free music and, and I warn you guys now, I don't know how it is right now, but back when I did it, sort of three years ago, and, uh, I would use their free music, which is supposed to be for Creative Commons, and whoever made the uh, music put it in Creative Commons, and later on changed it over to uh, YouTube's, uh, you know, regular uh, copyright. And uh, all of a sudden, I started getting hit on uh, YouTube because of copyright infringement for videos that were supposed to be free. The music was supposed to be free, you know. And from that day on, I just stopped using it. So now I'm going to give it another try. And hopefully, it doesn't happen again. But what I do here, before I end this video, I wanted to point it out to you what I here is I've got YouTube video or music here. And these are all the music that I use for YouTube uh, videos. And this is all the music that I have for um, Facebook music. And I've already made a part of the videos that shows how I put the music onto my videos in previous uh, in, 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 a, in a few previous videos that I've had. So I'm not gonna go over that, but um, basically what I do is I come back down here again, and here in my uh, ending video, when it pops up down here, I give it out, and I put the Facebook music in the background, and I do the whole procedure over again, and that's it, you know, I'm done. So, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and get off of here and end this video. I, um, like I said, I'm not going to do the whole tutorial thing where I'm acting like I'm teaching or something or anything. I'm just going to go through and do things, you know, the way I usually do it. And if you want to watch me and see how I do things, then that's fine. Um, all I got to say is, you know, each each person has to do their their setup completely different, okay? Just because I'm showing you this doesn't mean that the way I'm doing it applies to you because there are different things that take into effect that you have to factor in. You have to factor in your voice, for one, because you have to adjust your voice to the OBS. Then after that, you have to constantly keep track of your audio. Don't ever get cut uh, off by and uh, make sure that everything's set up beforehand, you know, and ready to go so that you're ready to go. Um, now, there are things that you need to do that we all need to do, and that's the first thing foremost is check your internet speed. Um, that is more important than anything else. I run on less than one millibyte per second, and I don't have the privilege of having three millibytes per second of upload speed, so I have to adjust my videos to um, low bit rate, and that cancels out, you know, me getting uh, messages and warnings on YouTube and Facebook because I'm automatically going to get it. I uh, have recently been uh, live streaming on these guys are on YouTube and Facebook with 20 millibytes per second, or 20 uh, frames per second FPS, and it's somewhat tolerating, and that's fine, you know, but before I had to keep it down to 12 FPS for any kind of video of mine to get through there, and uh, very lately I've been able to work with it, but, you know, that's a good thing, but that's better how I have to do it and like I said you know
Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, share, make comments. We love feedback.